All right, so I bought this Lossogy 12 volt, 20 amp hour LifePo 4 on Amazon. Um, you know, some guys test these batteries, these cheaper batteries, to see if they're any good. I decided I'd like to start doing that. Um, I'd like to build some better battery boxes. I do Aries, so it'd be nice to have, you know, non horribly expensive battery options if the batteries prove to be decent. So we've got this Lossogy hooked up to my CBA, CBA4. We're going to go ahead and give it a test. We're going to discharge it at 4 amps because that's about 20% of the battery. And it is the standard charge rate of the battery. So we're going to use that as a standard discharge rate. Um, I did charge the battery with my 10 amp hour charger yesterday. It seemed to take it fine. It does have a max charging of 20 amps. So I was well within safety there. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and get this test started. Um, I'll give you some nice screenshots when we're done here. We'll just let this run most of the day and see what it does. All right, so the battery's done running. Um, it measured 21.843 amp hours. That's 109.2% of what the battery advertises itself as. Uh, it measured at 279.937 watt hours with a test time of 327 minutes. So, yeah. If we take a look at the chart, we can see that around 20 amps, we were still about 12 and a half volts. We dipped below 13. Oh, we dipped below 13 at about seven and a half amp hours, but we were above, above 12 and a half volts until I'd say almost 20 amp hours exactly. And then between 20 and 21, we started to see a drop off. And once we got past 21, it pretty much free fell. Not bad. Uh, I'm very happy with this Lossogy 12 volt, 20 amp hour lithium iron phosphate battery. I'm going to charge it up again. And yeah, this is probably going to go in one of my battery boxes. Definitely check it out. Link is in the description. This isn't advertised. I bought this with my own money. I just wanted a 20 amp hour battery. I wasn't sure I wanted something like 50 you know, amp hours. It's getting kind of big. I want something that was relatively portable. And throw this in the battery box that I have that's currently missing a battery. And yeah, we'll go from there. I expect some more of these videos. I would like to get a 50 amp hour battery at some point. So I'll probably do that, and I'm likely going to check out some of these other cheaper 20 amp hours so we can use them uh, with our Aries work or just so I can, you know, show you guys them. So, yeah, thanks for stopping by. Link in the description, and yeah.